Hello, I'm Ejecta One, and welcome to another episode in Sign of My Survival World. And in and since the last video, I have worked on this area. Now it might not look all that different, but you will notice uh, the first major change is that I have covered up all the water, or except for that. And so now it's all grass. And I also uh, uh, took this. What is it? A yeah wall. I took this wall and I brought it down to the minimal uh, spacing I needed for it to keep the water in, but make it nice and flat. Um, yeah. But you won't really notice the major changes until you come down here. And this does get extended a little bit, and that is so it matches up with this, which will eventually be the uh, main waterfall. And yeah, so I also so I built this to kind of go like that, and... It's our evidence to, I am kind of working on the, ter I did work on terraforming a little bit here. I did also carve this out, so this is freestanding. I will probably add some kind of uh, support piece right there, just because I don't really trust it being like that. I think it would be a lot more interesting if I had something to, hold, to uphold it, but that's just what I've been working on. And I was going to work on this. Uh, I was going to sort of continue this, but I figured that might be a little too boring. And, uh, yeah, I'm still working out what I want to do with this exactly. Otherwise, I'd work on that. But I think we're going to work on this. Now, this area, I was thinking, I was having a little bit of a thinking, um, as I normally do. Let's cover that up. And, uh, hi, pig. My dog will sit up there. Um, uh, I was thinking, I want to turn this into... Now, this is going to, now, for those of you who don't know, this is going to be my Zen garden or kind of like a little relaxation space. And so I was thinking that w this area could be a really cool entry point into, uh, I was thinking that this would be a really cool area to have a, um, basically have one of those like zigzag waterfall things, uh, sort of like when you want to create like tranquility or. I don't know, it's like sort of like those uh, little ornaments or knickknacks that people tend to have. And uh, I think it'd be really cool. And so I really want to turn this into that. So I'm not sure how well that's going to work, but we'll see. And I will probably terraform this later so it's more flat. I did also uh, open this up so this connects to there. And uh, yeah, so it just looks a lot better. So let's go ahead and tear this out. And I'm just going to use this water block. It's already turning nighttime again, is it? Yeah. Nighttime goes by really fast in this world. Um, but yeah, so I am going to try and uh, work in some sort of uh, little design here. I really want to, and I really want to set myself a little bit of a challenge, where I want this to sort of let me turn that rain down for myself. I want to turn I want to try and just use this water to create the flow so like no additional water is needed to create the flow it just does it itself and uh, yeah we're probably gonna need to go sleep because it's gonna I know some people don't like the rain I don't mind the rain but and I guess in a Zen garden it you know in a Zen garden of sorts it does make sense but I don't really have in, any interest in keeping the rain going Plus, it makes it better visually. Okay, so we're going to take this, and I want this to zigzag. So, yeah, it's all going to be based off that one water spot. I will try to keep this from going into there. Oh, great. Pig! Wah! Pig, get out. Crazy pig. Okay. So now we have that. Let me... And I will carve this out so it's facing uh, from... So when you're standing there, you could look at it. And then I do want to have at least a little bit of space here. Now I'm thinking. Oh. 
All right, so now we want to go here. All right, so now we want this. Pig, you are getting in my way. And I sort of want to go... Let's see, do I want to do two blocks or three blocks? I think we'll go two blocks, because I want to create something that's nice and long, but still kind of cool. And actually, no, I think we'll go three. Why not? All right, so that's three blocks. So now we need to go here. Give me my other shovel. And I will dig these out later. I just want to get this going first. All right, so... Now I'm thinking. This does kind of throw it off. Let me tear this out here. All right, so let's take this and we'll just mask this off. I will redecorate this into something more cohesive later but for right now this is fine okay now we have that now I want to bring this across just like that and then we'll create a whoops and then we can take this and have it go here. And then that can come all the way here. We find out where it stops and we drop it down again. Um, I want to bring that up. Because we don't want it. I mean, we could have it like that, but it wouldn't be as cool, I don't think. Even though it is going to go that way. And then we will take... Oops. That. Okay. That falls down there. And that is where we want to go next. So... I think I want to go three each for this. I think that would probably be the most appropriate. So that's one, two, three, and then that is the wrap around. So let's just do this. Okay, now we get to go here. Here goes the flood. Yep, as I suspected. That's okay. okay find out where that drops down. Pig, you are really getting in my way. Okay, now. Cut that into there. All right, so now what we want to do is drop that down. And then just cut that off. All right, next I need to cut into here. I get as close to here as possible with this. That's your wall.
It's a little bit of granite here, but that's fine. This is almost to the ground. So we got one more layer. I think what we'll do is we'll have it to where it'll drop down somewhere here and it'll uh I'm thinking maybe it'll I'm thinking it will trail off over here. I probably won't do that today cuz I do want to re I do want to redesign this to uh, look more like a Zen waterfall or look a lot better. Okay. So what we want to do is dig this out and dig that down. Okay, next we want to go one, oops, two, three. Pig, you may want to move. As I told you. And we are actually at the ground level, so this is actually perfect. So now we can actually take this. And I think what we want to do... Yeah, so I actually, okay. I just want to figure out where I want to put this. I could leave that, though. I could leave that. And then this will eventually just come down here. And that will sort of be our little escapement piece Oops. of course I'll have to mind all that and then this will all be filled in I do need to find my bucket I have no idea where that's at right now and then I think what we'll do from this point is we can go ahead and cover all this up Okay, now what we want to do, there's actually something I want to do with this, is I want to, of course, oops, not that. So something I want to do is I want to take this and I want to see if we can do slabs. I do have a lot of cobblestone, and I think that would be the most appropriate for this. So let's take some cobblestone slabs. It's probably way more I'll ever need, but now I want to take all of the top dirt yeah I think I'll leave this like this for now because I do like the idea of having a tunnel uh, maybe we'll do like that just so kind of evidence we'll clear this way so you can still see it I might do something with this though I don't know um, now what I want to do is take the take what I have and turn it into a shovel because I need a new one for this next step you need the shovel and then oh I didn't go out far enough okay that's not good Whoops, just realized that. So we actually... So we actually need to go here. Place that there. There. And that should go down there. Now what I want to do, and it's going to get to nighttime again. Now what I want to do is start from... I think what I'll do is I'll start by taking out all this excess. Because I want this to be completely visible. Oops. Let's go to sleep really quick. And then let's eat some bread, because why not? And then we'll continue our work by... ...of getting rid of all this excess that I know I won't need. Uh, 
Okay, that's gonna flow into there. Uh, that's fine. For now. Now what I was thinking is, this can get taken away up to the minimum, minimum. And I was thinking, what if I take this slab and like, what if I take slabs and make it evident where So like, I was thinking, what if I take slabs and make it where you can see where the water goes? So you still kind of see where the water flows to. And then... Yeah, so I'm thinking, like, what if we take this, make this sort of where the water, that was not what I wanted. Oops. Let's see if this actually works still. That looks magical. That looks cool. Alright, so now we have that. Uh, put that there. It's probably ruined the idea of the grass being here, but that should be fine. Place that there. And then we'll take this out this is, and this could be sort of as if like some of the water runs off into here sometimes so now we want to take I believe that we don't want that I think we'll take this and we'll have that stays dirt. But then we'll take the dirt and we'll break it down to this. Because I want to keep... So my idea with this, uh, to explain what's going on, I want to make it so when you're looking... Because right now you can't really see the water too well. So I'm wondering if it would be better to have, like, you can kind of see where the water comes down from. I mean, it's kind of not the greatest, but you can still kind of get an idea of where it comes from. This might look better from a sky view, I think, but... I think it looked really cool still. So you can kind of see the water. Hmm. And if we take... Oops. Wrong tool. We'll take that. That was not the right block to go there. Okay, that goes there. We'll take you. And I want to try and keep it somewhat visible. And then we'll do, like, let's say this. Wrong tool again. Okay, now we have that. Sort of kind of follow where the water goes. And then this can we 
sort of have that. Right. I think what we'll do is we'll take that. Try and make it look a little natural. Right. So I think we'll have that. Then we can actually have... That can come up there. I think we can leave that there. Whoops, fell down. All right, we'll leave this here. What we can do instead is. Can we place a slab there instead? And then we can keep the water visually there yeah okay that works and then sorry if I'm not speaking a lot guys I'm really trying to figure this out here water is a little bit confusing in Minecraft sometimes um, no so it's got to go there okay I think we'll... I feel like that kind of cuts it off too much, though. So we'll probably get rid of some of this. Yeah, I think we'll just take this out. Alright. going to take dirt and build it there and then I want to get rid of this granite because it doesn't feel very zenful in this area that'll just flow there it's sort of like an item filter or an item transport Now just kind of get rid of this because I don't want stone here. I could make all this all stone. I could change that. Uh, you got if you guys have any ideas, let me know what you think. If this should be all dirt or if I should turn this into stone, I could even use diorite. But I know diorite is kind of a controversial block, so I might not use that. Uh. Okay. Anyways get rid of that I could put the little thing back but I don't uh, I don't know now this we want to dig and dig place place and then we will dig And then dig, dig. And then place. And then dig, place, dig, place. Okay, so I think that looks pretty good. It does need a lot of work. But I think we, we're getting somewhere. Hmm. I don't know. It's sort of just a concept, I guess. And then I will need to get my water bucket. I don't know. I think that looks pretty good. Uh, I think I might swap this out for uh, Deep Slate. Or for cobble deep slate and stone kind of stuff just to make it look a lot more uh visually appealing and to because a lot of those uh uh water fount those little water fountain knickknacks i'm talking about they kind of have like they're a lot more stony 
and because grass would, you know, dirt would just uh, wilt away really easily, so I am not going to do that. But it's sort of an idea, and I think sort of a concept. I'll probably work on it in the background, or I'll work on this in between episodes um, to try and make more evident. I think we could do, I think, because I want to have one that sort of just, can we do this with this one? Sort of just breaks off there. And but if we do that, it's got to go. Oops. That's not what we want. Yeah, if we do that, it's got to go there. I think that could work. Something that makes it interesting with that. I don't know. I'll still play around with this idea. Um, I think maybe half blocks aren't such a good idea with this, but uh, not sure. Actually, I don't think that would be a good spot anyways. Instead, what if I did... What if I do right here and let it drop down? Which would make that area, which would make that spot a lot more interesting. Eh, no, it kind of takes away from that. I think. I don't know. Uh, you guys let me. You guys have to let me know what you think. Um, just kind of a concept. Uh, just having some kind of like little Zen water area. Uh, I'll probably work on this a little little bit off camera, but um, yeah. But I think. That is probably going to be all the time we have for today, guys. Uh, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe. And, uh, you know, we do have a Discord where you can help uh, come up with the plans for this kind of stuff. But, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys still like it anyways. And if you did, please, words, I'm repeating my words, please leave a like and subscribe. It does mean a lot to me, and it really does help out the channel. And uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And until my next video, guys, I'm Ejected1, and you have been ejected.